In this session, we are going to discuss about reverberation. The objectives of this session are to understand about reverberation, to understand about multiple reflection of sound. Reverberation. Now we are going to listen to a sound, the sound of bells. What is the specialty of this sound? This sound is persisting, right? Persistence is because of the multiple reflection. Sound is undergoing multiple reflection. Because of this multiple reflection, there is a persistence of sound. It is known as reverberation. The repeated reflection that result in persistence of sound is called reverberation. Now we are going to discuss about multiple reflection and its use. If the sound is undergoing continuously reflection, it is known as multiple reflection. We can use this multiple reflection for various purposes. Megaphones. Megaphones making loud sound because of multiple reflection. These are megaphones. It is used to make announcement. The working principle of megaphone is multiple reflection. Next one is stethoscope. The, this device is used to measure the heartbeat. When the sound is getting inside this stethoscope, sound will undergo continuous reflection and it will reach to the ear. Generally the ceilings of concert hall or conference hall and cinema hall are curved so that sound after reflection reaches all corners of the hall. It is a source of sound. From this source, the sound will spread everywhere because of the reflection from this curved ceiling. It is curved ceiling, it is sound box and the sound will strike here and it reflect and it will reach it will reflect and it will reach to the listener and, and the sound will spread throughout the hall 